to week 10. Uh, so this week the baby is the size of, I think, a kumquat, which is about 3 centimetres, I think. Um, which is really, really good and really, really exciting. I know I've been having problems with my week 9 upload. I cannot get it up to save my life. For some reason, it just doesn't want to upload. So it's driving me mad and I have, like, cancelled it and retried to do it and I've retried to edit it and do it. It just doesn't seem to like that video very much. So as soon as I can get that up, I will. This one will be going up as ASAP, so hopefully I'll be able to get them all up together, which will be really, really, really helpful. Um, this week's gone pretty good, to be truthful. Um, annoying cat trying to attack my um, game. I've just bought Sims 4 and trying to install it, and the cat is trying to um, harass it. So she's going to sit here, hopefully, and be nice. Lie down, pretty kitty. Lie down, pretty kitty. There we go. So hopefully she'll stay so. So this week's been pretty good. Um, my morning sickness is pretty much faded. Um, I'm still very tired and my skin is still terrible. I am so spotty, it's unbelievable. Um, I've gone blotchy as well, which isn't been too good. I am still gone off of like tea and coffee, which is a bit annoying. But I like roast dinners. I had a roast dinner at my mum's house yesterday and I like it, so that's still good. Um, I mean, I'm, I'm so excited now, but the only problem is because of my morning sickness has gone, I'm panicking a little bit because I haven't got much signs of pregnancy anymore, and I am, you know, starting to panic that something's not right, and so I cannot wait for my scan, which is on the 18th, which will be, thank, oh, thank God for when it, um, for when it comes. I cannot wait. For that, that day to come just to make sure everything is okay that I'm just panicking so badly um, this week I've obviously been quite manic and very stressful because Ed was uniform he starts school on Monday and it has taken ages for all his stuff to turn up literally just come in the nick of time and tonight I get to iron all the labels on um, I feel very bloated this week and very gassy like horribly gassy um, and it seems that after I eat, my belly pokes out, which then people ask me if I am pregnant, and I'm like, you wouldn't notice, but you know, I eat, I bloat, meh, you see something. Um, so, other than that, I don't think I look pregnant. I think I've gotten, I, you can see, like in the video, I hadn't that long eaten breakfast, so I've got the bloat from eating breakfast. It's literally, as soon as I eat, I bloat, and it's literally within, pff, not even a stupid amount of time, I bloat. And it just bloat. So I'm like, what are you doing? Um, but yeah, I'm, I'm excited. Like, we are, ex we are excited. I'm more so than Jay, but that is only because I've gone through all this before and Jay's not done it, and he doesn't really know when to get excited and when to things to happen and stuff like that. The other thing is that... Um, my pelvis is my pelvis is really really sore. Like when I walk, it it hurts. It's like really I don't get it. It's you know as if you the place where your leg joints go in, it both sides hurts. Hurts when I walk. Hurts very painful. Like is that normal? I do not know. Like at all. And the other problem is oh this is my question. When did you first feel your baby move? Like seriously, because the other night I was like lying there, and I swear to God I felt it. But I know people were like, "You're ten weeks, you can't feel it." I swear to God, I felt it. Like it just, it just felt like somebody's going like that, but inside of me, like literally, a really like, ugh. And I felt it. I swear to God. So when my question is, when did you first like feel your baby move? And the other thing is, is it normal to have really sore achy hips at like 10 weeks? Because they're really sore, really pink. And a bit in the wind, to be truthful. And they've got like this weird reflux thingy going on. It's like, <clears throat> good, it's all good. But other than that, this week's going to be pretty short because obviously not a lot's gone on. But I will let you know what goes on. If I can get my week 9 up, it is driving me mad. But yeah, thank you for watching guys, like and subscribe and we'll see you again for week 11. Bye!